not that's not a problem, but it's expensive. Well, let me explain to you. You know, the states now they've changed most of their security uh, measures. You know, whatever you're bringing in is very scrutinized, and um, we need a lot of documents to be able to bring in such a consignment of funds into your country. We need proper documentations so that we have to get from the Irish authorities, the Irish government, and um, like from the government office. But we have to register the funds here because the state. They want to know where your funds is coming from and where it's going. So bringing in, bringing the consignment to the states, I have to fly personally with it over there, and it's going to cost us close to about um, twelve thousand dollars. Oh, that's no problem. That, Go ahead. And that you have to pay. We can't bring it there. Right? That that is a, that is expensive to us. And um, oh no, we, 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 think, I'll pay you back for that. That's that's, that's okay. That's quite reasonable, actually. Uh, twelve thousand dollars is. Is uh is pretty reasonable. So that, that's twelve thousand dollars. We have to get an agent, get a ticket for him, and bring it over there. Then you have to clear it in American because you have to bring it into America. It has to be cleared over there. So by the end of the day, before we'll be able to get it out from uh, uh, America from the airport, deliver it to our branch consignment, uh, our branch depot, whoever in the state, it's going to cost you close to probably twenty twenty five thousand dollars. Twenty five thousand dollars. Yeah, about twenty twenty five thousand. Because okay. the state to bring in a consignment, you need to clear it to almost ten, twelve, fifteen thousand in the airport there in America. That's how it's very expensive. That's how we don't go out there. We uh, because of the way it is, we expect our clients. If we have a client from the state, we invite them over here. It's not long. Uh, a day's trip to sort everything out, and everything will be officially and uh, sorted. Okay, great. So, so case, I'll, I'll break it down. I'll send you an email and break down the options for you. So whatever options you need to, you, you feel is better, then you pick, you go with that, and we'll start working on that, okay? Okay, now, I, I know we've been chewing the fat for a while here, but basically the option I want is for uh, the consignment to come to St. Louis, rather than me send a guy all the way to the other end of the world again, because we already did that once, okay? I came down... I somebody to play before. Okay, yes. And so this time I want someone to actually come to the, the St. Louis airport, and um, and uh, with the I, consignment. I, so, all right. Can I come in there? You said you you came down way before. Yes. Well, once before, but I, I was stood up. Uh, no one uh, came where, to the where airport. Where did you go to? Well, I, I I oh, what was the name of the place? I wrote it down here. It's uh, oh god, what was it was uh? Let me see if I can find it. Um. Uh, oh God! What was the name of it? It's it's that country that has the initials uh, United Arab em Emirates. Anyway, that's why I United went the first time. Arab Emirates, and you went there. When was this? Oh, uh, oh, it's been over a month now. I can't remember the exact date. I'm afraid my I'm I'm still drowsy. But um, yeah, it was like two months ago. Yeah. You went there. Yeah, you went there, and you were stood up at the airport. Yes, yes, I came there and everything, and they, they had a, um, you know, with the, I was there with the documents, and I, I waited around, and then I, I had to leave, because uh, my plane was going to take off five hours after I landed, so the whole idea is I land there, I, I take care of the business, and then I leave right away, and no one ever showed up, okay, so I, I really don't want to have to do that again, so if you would come down to um, St. Louis, I'll go ahead and pay for those little extra things, okay? And okay, uh, what I'll do is um, I'll have to check in with my staff and I'll get back to you. Okay, now roughly now. about how much would it cost for you to come to St. Louis? Just roughly. You don't have to be exact. Um, roughly within within twenty to twenty five thousand dollars. Okay, that that's uh, reasonable. Okay, I I think uh, I can afford that. Why don't you fly down to St. Louis and uh, work work send it in the email and uh, we'll work it out. So uh, you know, because frankly, getting stood up that was uh. The five five hours of the longest time I've ever spent. So if we can avoid that again, Jesus I'll be very happy. Well, that was not my company, and I don't understand what that happened to you. No, I, that wasn't you. That was that was the other ones. Yeah. That was uh, uh, Stella, I think. Uh, Stella Harrison, or yeah, I think it was Stella Harrison from like a zillion years ago. Okay, anyway, she she was the one who screwed that up. So that that's not you. It's just I you can understand why I don't want to have to go to the airport again. Anyways, we'll get back to you when we sit in tomorrow, okay? I'll send you an email and you receive my email and you get back to me. Okay, I'll do that. Okay. All right, then. All right. Have a lovely day. Bye-bye. Hey, you too. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.
Wow, I wonder if I can get this putt to actually come all the way to St. Louis. That'd be great. I can videotape him then. I can hide somewhere in, in the airport and videotape him waiting there. That'd be great. 